do 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 Hello! <laughs> I'm British today. That's right. I'm British today. Um, hi, sisters. How are you? It's nice to chat. It's nice to talk. Um, I'm just trying to open up my Twitch chat as well. I'm live on Twitch, baby. I'm live on Twitch, baby. I think. I don't fucking understand that shit. I'm sorry. All right. Let's see. Uh... Let's see, let's see, let's see. I just got a notification that I'm live on my Discord. Live on my Discord. If you become a member, you get access to the Discord. God, what a loser. Shit. What a loser. Okay, live on live on Twitch. All right. Zero viewers on Twitch. And that's the way I like it. Um, and then <laughs> let's check out uh, YouTube. Oh, someone, <laughs> there's one person in my Twitch chat. Yes! Heck yes. Gosh darn it all. That's exactly what I've been looking for. All right. So we're just going to get straight into it. Um, Shane Dawson has released a new video. And this one happens to uh, bother me a little bit. Um, because here's the thing, right? <sighs> He has always, um, like, had this old YouTube mentality, you know? It's terrible. Like, his shit is so fucking terrible right now. And I feel like I have to cover it. Because nobody else really is, and he can't keep getting away with it. Carly, thank you for becoming a sister. He can't, all right? Uh, Despresso gifted five subs. Thank you so fucking much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, also to everybody, uh, who wants to become a member, I have a bunch of streams I streamed with. Thank you, Jennifer, for, become, for becoming a member. I streamed with Gabby Bell for like 10 minutes in Florida and Chris James and Gunner and, uh, all them and members get access to that. And then, uh, also if you're on Apple now, you can become a sister right from your phone. It's an in-app purchase now. What the heck? What the balls? That's amazing. I'm broke till I get paid, but here's $5 for the hell you're about to be put through. <laughs> thank you, Moon Burritos. And uh, thank you, Lindsay, uh, for the $2. Perfect. Oh, yes. Thank you, everybody in the, in the Twitch chat as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Well, here's the thing, everyone. Um, also, if you become a, 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 like, use your Prime sub uh, on Twitch, I'll give you a little shout out as well. Um... Cool, we are off. We are off and running, baby. Thank you, Death Noted, for becoming a sister. Um, so Shane's video is called "Trying the Craziest Food Hacks Ever," <laughs> and unfortunately, it was posted 11 days ago. And I've been sick again. This is my fourth time getting sick. Lemon, thank you for becoming a sister, and uh, thank you for uh, thank you, Left Coast Cutie, for becoming a, a sub with Twitch Prime. Um, but here's the thing. All right. I was, I've been sick four times this month. It's been terrible. It's been God awful. And, and now I'm back. Now I'm back to scream on Twitch and YouTube. And that's my goal, baby. My, my immune system is gone. It's completely gone. And that's good. No, that's great. That's great. Thank you, Mike, for becoming a sister. Now, okay. Let's just get straight into it because, uh, you know, let's, let's just, God, if this works, this could be a game changer. I can tell. I can tell. Can? I can tell. Oh my God. Ah! Ready? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm excited. Oh, oh, my, oh my God. God. Unblur it. Why are you blurring something that much? Thank you. Armadildo for giving me $10. Thank you, used puppet and Crocs for subbing with Prime. What the hell is this blurring? Can somebody explain this to me? My God. Also, thank you, my bluebird, for donating 10. This is the whole frame. Wires, thank you for becoming a sister. This is the entire frame. Stop blurring. I just want to see. <laughs> I just want to see the fucking content. Or don't put this in at the beginning. 
The fuck? Also, a hype train on Twitch? The fuck does that mean? Sorry. You could do this to anything. <laughs> you could do this to anything. Margo, thank you for becoming a mega sister. Yes! God, I'm in a screamy mood. I also have this weird fucking piece of shit thing. Um, and it was $4, but I wanted to try it on stream because um, I thought it was interesting. AZ, thank you for becoming a sister. I love you. Um, okay. Let's try this. I think it's gluten-free, dairy-free. Let's see. It's fine. It's gross, though. It's gross. Um, uh, hype train. Uh, ibuprofen subbed at tier one. The fuck? Um, anyways. <laughs> anyways. What the fuck is that? Hi, you and Hannah have been getting me through the last couple of months. Life has been sucking, but you guys are coolio. Jessica, thank you so much. I will let Hannah know. Hannah's Hannah's uh, home right now. And uh, Arrow, thank you for becoming a super sister. A do -do 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 super sister. God. God. Anyways. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. Welcome to the pantry. It's like three in the morning right now. This is... I thought this would be fun and like cute. Like, let me show you my pantry. And now this looks like a horror movie. So. <laughs> no, it's because of you. You make this look like a horror movie. Helos, thank you for the 10. And Galagni, thank you for subbing with Prime. You make this look like a horror movie. It's this, this angle, this lighting. Honey, thank you for subbing with Prime. The fuck? That's a hell of a, a hype train if you ask me. I don't know what that means. Uh, imagine waking up and that is standing over you. Why would he be standing over me? I love you, Jordan, but why would he be standing over me? Molly, thank you for becoming a sister. Jennifer, thank you for the five. First dream, and I'm so proud of how far you've come. Uh, I've had UC since I was 16, and I relate so much. One mil, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Moon Burritos. Shane Dawson is the horror movie. Absolutely. Absolutely. fucking lootly. What the fuck? Not really what I planned. I guess I'll leave the pantry. Oh, my God. Sam, coming thank out you for the, the two. I got it. It's like when you're coming out of the closet for your eating disorder. So what does that mean? So can you explain to me what the fuck that means? Somehow still existing. Thank you for subbing with Prime. Um, what? Coming out of the closet for your eating disorder? Does he think that this is like a relatable thing? He's like, he, you just got out of cancellation, man. What's going on? <laughs> What the fuck? What are you saying? Willow, thank you for the donation. Oh. <laughs> That's very dark. So yeah. I yeah, don't fucking say it then. That's very dark. Yeah, shut up. Jordan, thank you for the five. Despresso, I'm hitting my dad pen right now and I cannot... I just can't not see Rumpelstiltskin when looking at Shane. That's true. That's true. Someone also said he only jokes about uh, eating disorders and being queer. It's true. There's no other material going on. I decided to do something a little different and turn on my camera in the middle of the night when everyone's asleep and I'm losing my mind. So yeah, I thought it would be uh, fun to take you along with me for one of my nights. Whoa, that sounds dark. One of my nights. <laughs> Oof. How the fuck does that sound dark, Shane? Izzy, thank you for the two ugly cherries. Thank you for becoming a sister. Sister, 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 sister. In soup mode, sub with Prime. Yes! Why the fuck are people arguing in my chat about me wearing glasses? Of course I wear glasses. I'm a nerd. I'm an idiot fucking loser. <laughs> Is that a special guest? Louie, come here. Come on, join the vlog. Don't worry, I'm not gonna eat you. Yet. Now I do have a plan for this video. Why didn't you show the animal? Was it covered in your cum? This wasn't it. I just decided Load to toast, thank you for something in the morning me. because the Baja Blast hit. <laughs> I was ready to go. But tomorrow we're actually going to be doing a very exciting part of this video, which is trying out something that I have been wanting to do for years. And I didn't know if it was possible. And I still don't know if it's possible, but we're going to try it tomorrow. But as for tonight, I am working on a few things on my computer. And I was thinking about it. And I'm like, well, in the last vlog, I told you guys about my horror movie that I'm trying to make and the... Oh, right, your horror movie. <laughs> All right, your horror movie that you're trying to make. That's good. That's good. 
Uh, Kelling for Mother, thank you for subbing with Prime. Uh, Luna donated $2 and said, Jake, can you do a little dance for me, please? Yeah, fuck it. I'll do a little dance for you, all right? But it will be to Shane Dawson's video. <laughs> That's right. Brutal, rocky journey that it's been on. And then three years into it, they said, okay, we don't have the money to make the movie anymore, but we want to make bobbleheads. So. And some... Oh, fuck. What the hell is this guy talking about? You know how <laughs> when you were in school and there would be like kids talking about shit that genuinely made no sense to you, but you just had to agree with them because you're like, yeah, no, I don't want to disagree with you in this moment. Some of you guys seemed Campbell, thank you for the dono. And I thought that was cool because I don't really talk about that kind of stuff. So I thought I would talk more about it and show you what I'm working on, which is a pitch deck that I'm gonna to show to investors and to studios and producers and hopefully get them interested in funding the movie and helping me. How relatable! <laughs> Today I'm going to be showing you my pitch deck that I'm going to be showing to investors and uh, hopefully you guys can relate and hopefully we'll get this funded. Ugh, your shit sucks. Make it, okay, I'm missing a fight. We need to go out there. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys some of the pitch deck and talk about that and then tomorrow, don't worry, we'll get into the real video. I don't know what this is. Okay, who's fighting? Yeah, I don't fucking know what this is either. Sorry, cat jump scare. <laughs> Look at this velocity zoom. Oh my God. Kai just donated and said, hi Jake, happy to have made the stream. I'm sad to see Shane posting another video. It's true. Willow, thank you for the two. Jennifer, thank you for the two. Did he not learn from Smiley? Great question. That's a really great question. Shane Dawson also made a movie called Smiley. That shit sucked. It sucked. It was so bad. And, and, and you know what? At the end of the movie, guess what I was? I was Smiley because it was so bad and I was excited that it was over. There's a hype train going on on Twitch right now and I'm about to beat my last record. Thank you, Twitch, for giving me that notification. <laughs> Louis. Oh my God. It's like they don't want me to see them falling in love, but I know that it's happening behind my back. Y yeah, yeah, you want to see that shit. I know you do. What the hell? I want to see my cats fuck. All right. God, that was sensual. We've moved to the kitchen. <laughs> Just my typical night. So there's a few things that I do at like three in the morning that are very embarrassing. And I don't know if anybody else does them. I'm gonna guess no. I walk around with no purpose. Like I just- I'm gonna cut him off right there. <clears throat> I don't think that this is going to be a unique experience for you, Shane. I'll say that right now. I don't think that this will be a unique experience for you. You're not that special. Chloe, thank you for becoming a sister. Everyone who's becoming a sister right now, thank you so much. I'm so fucking happy that Apple has made it so that iPhone users can become uh, members. That's so fucking nice. And Yamama's Candy Yams gifted a tier one sub on Twitch. Just like walk in circles. And sometimes I'm listening to a podcast or sometimes I'm like playing a movie out in my head. So like I'm starring in the movie and I'm like answering the fake phone that is my hand and I'm like, hello, who is this? No, you're right. The, you're the only person who disassociates <laughs> at night. Uh, just a random sapphic says, uh, fellow ex Shane fan here. I used to believe his stupid conspiracies, but luckily I grew out of that. That's good. And honestly, that's the shit that he's been doing for so fucking long is he's made everybody because we were all so like young and impressionable when he was popular. Right. And it was so easy for us to be like, Yes, um, 9-11, let's question it. I'm not kidding. That's shit that he would actually fucking post, right? And then you would get a group of kids who were all like, interesting. I, you know what? I'm going to think outside of the box. And that's how you become a fucking psychopath, okay? You've raised psychopaths, Shane, and I'm one of them. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what that accent was, but you get it. You get it. Who is this? Sorry, I don't know who this is. Maybe you have the wrong number? We're doing bits! What are you talking about? By the way, this is when I'm all alone. I don't know what's more embarrassing. The fact that I'm emotionally invested in my cat's drama or this. Okay, so I guess... All of it. No, all of it. All of it was bad. And it sucked. And it wasn't good. 
this should be explaining what we're doing tomorrow. Ooh, but before I do that, do you guys want to see my blank cups? I know. It's something that nobody wants. Nobody's asking for this. But I'm gonna give Farzan, you guys thank you for sending my blank cups. cups. Well, first of all, not sponsored, but uh, these are my cups, my little conspiracy cups, and I've been <laughs> This is merch. I think it's actually sponsored though. <laughs> what are you talking about? Not sponsored, but here's my merch. Hey, everyone, not sponsored, but check out Never Stop, <laughs> my clothing brand and fund for people with chronic illness. What the fuck? Not sponsored, but I do make money when you purchase this. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, yeah, Twisted Rage. Yeah, that's... Uh, you're not the only one, and it sucks. Uh, how does someone build an entire career on racism and Diet Coke? Great question, doggo. Uh, he made me think peeing in water bottle was okay behavior. I am so glad that I'm not the only one who experienced this. He legitimately said, he was like, I have a bottle next to my bed and I piss in it every day. And then I was like, oh yes, that's good. And then I did that sometimes. And then my mom would find my fucking pee bottles and she was like, that's not a thing. That's not a thing. And can you stop? And it smells. And then, and then I had knee surgery and I had no option but to pee in bottles. It was full circle. I've been using them ever since I got the prototype and I love it. A prototype? Oh, nice. <laughs> oh my God. NASA wow. thing? No, I don't need your judgment. I probably paid $150 per cup, which is a joke. It's cr You don't need my judgment, but you're getting it. Also sick for the seventh time this year. Thanks for the entertainment. Thank you, Amanda. Yeah, I uh, immune systems are fucking terrible. I just started taking so many supplements today because I'm like, I'm done. I'm sick of this. I need to push out content. I'm posting five videos a week. Who else is doing that? Crazy. And I thought that it was too expensive when I would get them on Etsy, but then I thought about like small business, a lot of bling, like somebody sitting there for hours blinging all of these cups. I'm like, you know what? $150 for my sad, weird obsession doesn't seem like that much. But let me just show you the one. No, it's that much. That's like a lot of groceries. That's a lot of groceries. That's food. <clears throat> and you got to what? Fucking three bedazzled cups. Cool. Ones that are my current favorites. And these aren't all of them, ladies and gentlemen. My cups. Oh, four. I mean, come on. Come on, it's worth wow. it. Wow. I just want to say this also. I designed these, some of them. So, for example, I got this cup, which is an ice cream drip cup. And I was so impressed with this that I went to the artist and I was like, yes, I said artist. Cats, I'm trying to vlog. So, so the video that you made in the past was like talking about uh, not like generic brand food and how weird and quirky that was. But now you're bedazzling fucking Starbucks cups, $150 a pop. You've got four of them. What the hell? Moon Burrito says, I will never understand how Shane still has fans. Good question. Good question. I went to the artist and I was like, hey, I have an idea. I want a cup that is black, that has flames around it, and that the flames are like creeping up. Like, And then look, she sent me this. Oh, that looks like a Guy Fieri fucking cock ring. What the fuck is that? Oh, what's that? That sucks. Oh my God. Why are you like bragging about that? Look at that. She needs an award. No, she I mean, doesn't. Made I mean, sorry. She's a small business. <laughs> she deserves. Well, but that is your design. Okay, so she deserves an award for putting up with your fucking Etsy bullshit. Her flowers. Is that a thing? Do people still say that? No, probably not. Her cup vibes are immaculate. I'm going to delete that from my vocabulary. Okay. You're 45! How old is she, Dawson? <laughs> You're 87, you fucking old man. Salem's Domain, thank you for becoming a sister. Yes, I love when people become sisters. Yes, uh, we're taking back the sister name. Okay, I obviously have my dad cup, which was something that I got a year ago because I was manifesting. And I was like, well, I really want to be a dad. So instead Honey of, Bean, that's know, actually a good point. finding a woman and impregnating her, I might as well just get a bling cup. What does that mean? What does that mean? Might as well get a blink. Dad. Dad, I'm 
might as well get a blink cup. Cool. <laughs> and guess what? We're gonna be dads. It worked. I just needed to, you know, get a sperm cup and fill it up and then find somebody who wanted to give us eggs. And they did. Anyways, back to my cups. <laughs> just another wild night. How did someone marry me? Okay. Good question. Cheese Louise. That's a pretty good question. Going back to my office. <sighs> so out of breath. Does anybody else get completely winded from like walking up one flight of stairs? Oh, the worst is when you're like winded and you're around other people and you have to pretend like you're not winded. So you do that thing where you just hold your breath <laughs> and just slowly die and you're like, The worst. Okay, so let me explain the plan for tomorrow. So tomorrow is Sunday, which means A, it's gonna be Rylan begging me to take him to open houses that are way too out of our price range. That is never gonna happen. And sorry, 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 sorry. Why are you looking at open houses? Did I miss something? You have a house in Colorado, a house in Los Angeles, and guess what? You're looking for another? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's good. Whereas, like, <laughs> most fucking Americans will never own a house and they'll just keep renting and getting abused by fucking landlords. He's like, I'm going to buy house number three. What the fuck? God damn. Edgar Allan Ho just gave me $2. That's awesome. And then we have to like socialize with weird, creepy rich people who have no social skills. So it's basically Bitcoin. No, <laughs> kidding. Realtors have no social skills? That's their only job is to like suck you in to spending so much money on houses. <sighs> Deep cut. But the main thing that I'm excited about is we're going to be trying a McDonald's hack that I have been wanting to do for so long. So I did not know that there was a name for this. Oh, goody! A McDonald's hack! <laughs> it's 2016 now. I've always wanted to see a Shane Dawson McDonald's hack. Oh, wait! That was his content fucking five years ago. Recently on the podcast, we were talking about McDonald nuggets, and somebody was like, did you know that there's different names for the shapes? And I was like, huh? So prepare yourself, because you already like, know this uh, information, but nobody's like, ever uh, told you this information in this way. Does that make sense? Probably not. Okay, so there's four nugget shapes. The bone, the ball, the bell, and the boot. <laughs> Who the fuck has put this much effort into McDonald's chicken nuggets? What the hell? And we all know the boot is the best. So if you look at the picture, you can see like the ball looks like, you know, like a basketball or something. The bell looks like, you know, like a standard like ding dong, ding dong. <laughs> this, this, this guy has fucking millions of subs. What's going on? <laughs> I'm gonna lose my fucking mind. Ooh, the Celtics are up. What the fuck is going on? It looks like a uh, like a natural normal bell where it goes ding bong. What? Basketball or something. The bell looks like you know like a standard like ding dong ding dong. <laughs> I just found my new favorite thing on the internet. Holy shit! Like a basketball or something. The bell looks like, you know, like a standard, like, ding dong, ding dong. <laughs> what the fuck is he doing? What is he doing? This is chicken nuggets, man. What? <laughs> Learning shapes with Shane. Absolutely. What the, the bone is like bone shape, so it's kind of like big at the top and then square and then big at the bottom. And then the boot. We all know what the boot looks like. You know the boot is your favorite. You I'm gonna be honest, I, I'm allergic to McDonald's nuggets, but I don't like these. Because you just called it a boot. A boot is a shoe. <laughs> if you didn't know that, Shane, a boot is a shoe. And I don't want to eat shoes. You just didn't know it was called the boot. The way that the boot gets into that sauce. Yeah, and the boot goes like, stomp, 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 stomp. And the bell goes, ding dong. <laughs> no shit. This is like kindergarten with Shane Dawson. Keep him away. It's the way that that boot is made for dipping, like. This is my favorite shape. Mm. Oh, good. He's crediting people now. Cool. Someone just became a sister. Let's see. 
Stevie, thank you for becoming a sister. Yes! This is my favorite shape. At least he's crediting people now. Steph Pappas. Mm. <sighs> Why do you keep that part in? Mm. <sighs> I need to calm down. So I was thinking about it and I was like, okay, the boots are the best, right? I'm like, I post in boots. That has nothing to do with anything. Did nobody else hear that? Is that one of those noises that only I heard and now I have to just pretend like it didn't happen? Because that sounded like death. That sounded like... That, sounded, that was so funny. That was really funny, Shade. Ooh, that sounded like that. That really made me chuckle, Shane. That was funny. I thought about it and I was like, okay, what if you went to McDonald's and you said, hey, can I get a six-piece Chicken McNuggets? All boots. No. No, I'll tell you that right now. Someone making seven fucking 50 an hour. If you, okay, listen, this will show Shane's privilege. If he goes to fucking McDonald's and goes, sorry, can you give me boots? Can you give me all boots? I want you to fucking sift through all of your chicken nuggies. And I want you to give me all the boots. <laughs> oh my God. Genius. How has nobody genius. thought of this? I Googled it. I looked on YouTube. I how has nobody thought of this? People have probably fucking thought of it, but didn't like realize that it would be a stupid idea. I looked everywhere. I saw nobody talking. I need to be quiet. So I'm like gonna wake up and be like, what are you talking about? And we'd be like, nuggets. And he's gonna be like, oh, okay, I get it. And he's gonna go back to bed. That's if a I funny bit, man. If I had a McDonald's meal, you know it would be all boots. All boots all day. And like, what if I ask for it? And if it like unlocks something, you know what I mean? Like what if Ronald himself comes out and he's like, you figured out my plan. <laughs> I mean, like, what if Ronald himself comes out and he's like, Motherfucker! Holy shit! What the fuck? You're middle aged! Stop! Get off YouTube! Oh my god! Oh my god! I don't know why he talks like that, but he does. There is one more hack I want to try at Taco Bell. So this was something I thought of randomly because my favorite Taco Bell meal item of all time was a grilled stuffed beef burrito. If you don't know what it is, first of all, I fucked it up. It's called the XXL grilled stuffed beef burrito, which I was like, representation matters. To have a burrito named after my size. Shut up! <laughs> my neighbors are gonna fucking call the cops. Oh my God. Shut the fuck up. Oh my god. To have a burrito named after me called XXL because I struggle with my body image? Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Oh my god. I can't believe that this is real. Guys, you okay had a representation. And that burrito was infamous. Like Thank you for pounds. becoming a sister. Dude, that girl stuff burrito is huge. Like they measured it, like they put it on a scale and they were like, mm, yep, that's gonna kill you. And I was like, I'll take three of them. I can't even fucking count to three. Lyra, thank you for becoming a sister. He's trying to do bits and shit. He goes, he goes fucking, he goes, I'll take three of them. Ready? Three of them. That's two. These are big YouTubers. I'll take three of them. Ooh, I'm gonna make a funny face. But they took it away. They took it away the same day they took away the Mexican pizza and the Fiesta taco salad. I never explained the hack. Okay, sorry. So Honestly, this is the most privileged video Shane's ever fucking posted because who gives a shit? People are dying. People have undiagnosed illnesses and he goes, I like the Mexican pizza and the XXL burrito. So here's what the hack is. The reason that burrito was so good is because they put it in that press. It's like the press that they put the um, crunch wrap in. It's like they go. You mean the, and like they make a tortilla it crispy, press? And then you get the burrito and it's like, 
oh, it's like a panini. And it's like crunchy and it makes everything, it's like melty and it like makes it. So then I thought they have. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I just. <sighs> panini. Give me one and second. One sec, guys. <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! just ate that shit out what the fuck people keep saying jake why do you hate us listen if i have to watch it you have to watch it too uh, this is trauma bonding uh moon burritos thank you for gifting a uh, membership my bluebird <laughs> just donated 25 dollars and said ding dong ding dong you figured it all out i'll take three of them cool thought, they have that press laying around like they use it for other things what if i ask them to put a just bean and cheese burrito in the press. And You're a fucking pain in the ass. Then it would make it like a grilled bean and cheese burrito. Do you see what I'm saying? You get it. And then if that works, I say what you're saying. you can do anything. The opportunities are endless. You could put, oh my God, you could put Cinnabites in it. Like imagine lining up little Cinnabites, like kids outside of a fire drill and then shh. I don't know why my mind went there. I know why your mind went there. She. I know why your mind went there. Straight to kids. Straight to kids. And then what? Fucking tortilla pressing them? Okay, so that's what we're doing tomorrow. <laughs> okay, so let me get to the movie thing because that's what I actually want to talk about. Not just, you know, all of my... Yeah, talk about your relatable fucking movie shit. My is not here. I think it's downstairs on the couch. Oh, this which tastes is like shit, but I keep drinking it. where I work. Like, I don't Shut up, man. My desk. Like, sometimes, but like... When Rylan goes to bed, I like sneak downstairs and I can get on the couch because like, who wants to work at a desk? Okay, let's go to the living room. Most of the population <laughs> has to. Um, and uh, get back to work. Also, my brother gave me a Richard Simmons bobblehead. Now, if you don't know who Richard Simmons is, I feel bad for you, but just like, look at this. Anytime I'm sitting here and I'm feeling like depressed or like I need motivation, I just press him. You know you're worth it. Why am I gonna cry? Every moment of every day. Yeah, that's that cool, man. so true. And sometimes I That's don't. cool, yeah, thanks. Thanks for showing Richard Simmons bobblehead. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, no, that's awesome. Yes, Richard, let's put this baby to work. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's right, cool. I'm at my actual desk. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to explain cool, what I'm about to show. And don't judge it too much. I love like, that show. I just started working on this. It's a... Oh! Guys! Guys, I just got a Twitch chat. It says, I'll, uh, I'll screenshot it. This is big for me. This is really big for me. All right. I think, honestly, I think that this is going to be like, lead to me hitting a million subs. This is actually so exciting. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Hi. I want to offer promotion of your channel, viewers, followers, views, chat bots. Cool sentence. The price is lower than any competitor. The quality is guaranteed to be the best. Auto on. Incredibly flexible and convenient order management panel. Everything is in your hands. Turn it on, off, customize. Go to doggletype.com. I think I'm going to go to dogletype.com right now. Oh boy. Put me on dogletype.com. I would love to bot my streams. That's cool. Bot my views. Cool, man. Thanks for that. A work in progress. So this is called a lookbook. So mine is like 10 pages and each page is a different part of the movie. So this is like what I'm going to show them and be like, okay, this is the movie I want to make. I have the script. If you don't want to read the script because you don't have time, here's the lookbook. So this really is kind of what sells the movie. So I'm going to show you a few pages of this. I might blur out the name of the movie because I haven't copyrighted it. Or Nobody's going to fucking steal it. I'll tell you that right now. You think people are going to steal your movie title? No. Why would you steal a fucking movie title of something that's going to die?
something that's going to fucking fail. Consider there's five dollars as a compensation for emotional damage. Thank you so much. You continue to incur by consuming <laughs> Shane's content. Yeah, that's true. Goob, thank you for becoming a sister. Thank you so much. Or whatever. Sorry. God damn. I don't know how that works. So I don't think I'm supposed to show the name yet, so it'll just be blurry. But I'll show it soon. Cause like You're going to blur this? To cool. Okay, so here's the title card. Ooh, I'm excited. I'm nervous. Okay, I'm excited. I haven't shown anyone this. I haven't shown Ryland this. Oh my God, this is scary. So yeah, this is... Yeah, I haven't shown Ryland to this. Uh, we actually don't talk outside of <laughs> things on camera. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Our relationship's on the rocks. I proposed on Toonies for nothing. Silly, silly little fellow. Thank you for the dono. Also, thanks for everybody on Twitch right now. For uh, for viewing and, and becoming people. Maybe I'll even become partner. <laughs> I don't even know what that means, to be honest. But if you want to become a sister, then go over to, to YouTube, please. Um, yeah, this title card looks really fucking cool, man. Directed by Shane Dawson. Written by Shane Dawson and Michael Gallagher. Now, I know that you can't see the Michael Gallagher thing. Michael Gallagher wrote Not Cool and Smiley with him, I believe, and it was a failure. So, cool. It's the title card, and then it has directed by me, and then written by me and my friend Michael Gallagher. I haven't even talked about that. So, Michael Gallagher, I've known him forever. Oh, my God. I've known him since, like, 2000. Why did you show this? I'm Britney Spears' guy now? Doink! Thanks for gifting a sub. What? 2008 or 2009? Shane Dawson? Who watches this crap? You know what? Just I agree. a second, I'm sorry. Is there a problem? Are you talking to me? Yeah, you, you fucking asshole. Is there a problem? And we've made a lot of stuff together. How many slurs you cut out? Hey, how many slurs you cut out? <laughs> I feel like you can't watch old Shane shit and like not see a slur or two together over the years like a lot of short films i've been in a bunch of his movies like yeah, yeah 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 they're all really successful god my favorite movie of all time yes yes i love smiley and a bunch of his movies like smiley 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 i love smiley god damn that shit sucks Internet famous. He's directed other movies that are incredible, like Funny Story, which won awards, and we just work really well. All right, let's see. Let's see how many awards it's won. Let's see. He's directed other movies that are incredible, like Funny Story. All right, it's called Funny Story. Cool. Five stars by the Movable Fest. Oh, you know the uh, critically acclaimed Movable Fest. <clears throat> oh, another five stars from the Movie Waffler. Oh, I know the movie Waffler. No, they're super popular. Oh, it was a winner at the 2018 Slam Dance Film Festival. What the fuck? It's like they wanted to call it Sundance, but it was already taken. Slam Dance. Cool. Oh, it, oh, it, it, it won Rhode Island International Film Festival. Oh, boy. Awesome story, which won awards. Jenny, thank you for the donut. really well together. And I think like three years ago, before I got canceled, we started writing this movie. Together. Stop talking about it like it didn't fucking happen. You made mistakes on the internet. Suck a wiener. Wow, my first time catching a live. Thanks for suffering for our entertainment, Jake. Greetings from Finland. Very cool. Thank you, Melanonymous. Together about a demon. Canceled. You know, just canceled. like chill things. Good energy. <laughs> you know, just like putting good energy into the world and waiting You've for good energy that. to come back. Yeah, so we wrote a movie about a demon and then I got canceled, which, listen, I'm not saying it's related, but I am saying, like, it was hell. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you did get canceled. Wouldn't it make sense for you to be like, like, to like acknowledge that? And be like, yeah, I made mistakes in the past. Instead of just brushing it over and being like, I got canceled. Whoops, I got canceled. Don't tell anyone. What? Admit it. Our process is kind of like, we'll talk about the story. We'll talk about characters. I'll go and I'll start writing. And then we meet again. And then we go through it. And he gives me ideas and notes. And it, it really is a collaboration. Cool. Thanks for telling us about the writing process. Yeah, if you've ever taken high school fucking English. And I just love working with him more than like anything. I love him so much. So I'm very excited about that. And it's crazy that I haven't talked about it yet. But also, side note, his name is Michael Gallagher, but his YouTube name is Totally Sketch. So I call him Totally Sketch. I have for the last 15 years. So if I slip and I say Totally Sketch, that's why. Okay, so then 
yeah, no, I don't humanize my friends. No, yeah, I call, uh, I call all my friends by their YouTube username. And, uh, by humanizing them, or by dehumanizing them, I keep the power position. The next page is called the log line, which is like one sentence that kind of summarizes the movie so that an executive could read it and be like, oh, okay, I get what this movie's about. This is the log line page. Roar is trapped. Thank you for becoming a sister. Let's go. Moon Burrito says, how many slurs slash offensive things do you think that he can fit in this new movie? That's a good question. I have no clue. How far does this shit go? Does he reference being canceled in this movie? Like, what is... I, I don't know. All of this, like, bothers me. He's just gonna, like, gloss over things. I don't know. This looks terrible. This looks really bad. I'm sorry. This looks f like fucking... This is, this, this is a Canva fucking thing. Yes, I make my thumbnails in Canva, but this is like bad Canva. After narrowly surviving a home invasion, a pushover single father must fight to save his family from a twisted conspiracy. Ah! More conspiracies? What the fuck is a conspiracy? You want to talk about the Boston bombing? Cool, man. What's the fucking conspiracy this time? The Challenger explosion? Cool, man. That was every fucking video you made in the past. You cover everything. Coco, thank you. Or Coso, thank you for becoming a sister. My brakes don't work. Thank you for becoming a sister. Let's go. Uh, okay, it says, after narrowly... Ooh, I feel like I should do this in a voice. Hold on. Like creepy music. Don't do it in a voice. After narrowly surviving a home invasion... I just read that. ...pushover single father must fight to save his family from a twisted conspiracy. Oh my god, I hadn't heard it out loud yet. Okay, this is very exciting. I just got chills at my own writing. It was so cool. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to go through a few more pages. I'm probably going to blur the actual like character descriptions and stuff. Because like I want you to be surprised when you see it. Hopefully. Oh, trust me, honey. I'll be surprised. Jenny, thank you for the two. I hope he puts his soul into it and goes bankrupt. How funny would that be? But also, this man has more money than God. Like, I don't think that people understand how much money Shane, <coughs> Shane Dawson has. What, two best-selling books? The movie was terrible and I believe he lost some money on it, but like, it's not, I don't know. Like it's, it's so fucking scary to me how much money this guy has and how he can put out 20 fucking movies and they can all lose $500,000. <laughs> like what? Hopefully if it ever gets made. So the main characters are Vince. He's 40. What? Okay. We've got Vince. He's 40. Who's this fucking guy? Maddie, thank you for becoming a sister. What's his name? James Charles? What's his name? What's his name? This, this is the guy from and Sonic. Single dad. Let's see. James Marsden. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, chat, you can stop. I get it now. So we've got James Marsden here. Great. And then we've got... He wants to cast Jacob Tremblay? What? He <laughs> One of the most fucking talented actors ever. What? Youngest or second youngest person nominated for a, for a Oscar for his performance in Room. And he's like, you know what? This is going to be perfect. This is going to be good. No, this doesn't mean that he casted these people. He wants off-brand versions of these people. God damn. And then Chase, the cool 12-year-old. And then his son Chase, who's 12. They don't have a very good relationship. Chase thinks his dad's a pussy. Vince thinks that he's a loser because he hasn't written a hit movie in a long time. And um, yeah, they go on a journey. And then we have Riley, who is... Yeah, Jacob Tremblay will not fucking take this role. I'll tell you that right now. Also, he's a king. Stay the fuck away from him. Deadly Nightshade. Oh, I hope you're doing... I hope you're doing better. Thank you for, for the dono. Kind of like a... I don't want to give it away, but she's done some stuff. Okay, I'm going to stop. That's it. <laughs> I don't want to give it away. Riley, who is kind of like a... I don't want to give it away, but she's done some stuff. Ooh, Riley. Riley, yeah. I don't want to give it away, but she's done some stuff. 
cool. Okay, I'm gonna stop. That's enough. And I'm not just saying that because I want to be like secretive. I just I like I don't know if I should even be showing this stuff because also if the movie never happens, it's like depressing, right? No, you know what? It will happen. You've got so much money, it will happen. But the movie's gonna happen because I'm manifesting it. Just like I manifested being a dad. I'm gonna get a cup that says the movie's name on it and it won't be a waste of $150 because it will happen. Right? This is the only time that I hope that manifesting doesn't work. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm going to buy a $150 cup and that means that this is actually going to work. For once. Okay, and then this page is the- ah! Too many words. Director's statement. In life's worst moments, we have all asked ourselves, should I just move to the middle of nowhere and start over? It's true. It's a thought that gives momentary relief in times of crisis. When things get tough, you can always just run away, right? <laughs> I'll do that in Shane's voice. You can always just run away, right? <laughs> well, in 2020, during the hardest year of my life, I had that exact thought. But instead... Of Oh, this is from Shane. The hardest year of your life was 2020. Yeah, that's a... What? That's a unique experience, man. What the fuck? But instead of running, I decided to face my challenges head on and come out of the other side a stronger person. That's when the idea for this film hit me. You've been thinking about it for, what, two years? Cool. I want to make a movie that captures the feeling of being strapped into a roller coaster. All right, I'm done. That shit sucks. The director's statement. So this is like a page where I explain what kind of movie I want to make, why I want to make it, and why they should give me the money to make the movie. No. Also, this movie, side note, is not the movie that I thought I was going to make three years ago. That movie I thought was going to be the one. So like two years ago, I was driving. So why would somebody fucking invest in that if you don't have any idea what you want to do? Like, what's the point? And he did run away. He went to fucking Colorado. He's like, I don't know if you heard of COVID, but I had that once. I dealt with COVID once. Everybody dead. No. Coming home from something with Rylan, and then I looked and I saw this old man standing in front of somebody's garage, staring out at the street, just standing, staring. It was like very, very scary. And I was like, should we call the cops? Like, <laughs> What color was he, Shane? <coughs> We're gonna call the cops on a man just standing in front of a garage? Hmm. With your history. Hey, what color was he, Shane? The fuck? God damn. It just looked really weird. And we didn't. <laughs> Probably should have. Anyways, we went home and I was like, well, what would happen if we pulled up to our house and there was just a stranger standing in front of our garage staring at us, not saying anything? What would we do? Literally, what would we do? Would we? I don't know. Nothing. I don't know. What the hell? We stay in the car. Would we get out? Would we like ask him like what's going on? Would we keep driving? So I came home and I wrote the entire movie. <laughs> so I came home. And there's a guy standing in front of my garage. And I was like, what the, what the? That's weird. The hell? This is his worst nightmare. Just a stranger. <laughs> Putting, standing in front of your garage. He's like, I live in a gated community. How did he get by? Like overnight. And I sent it to Toy Sketch. And I was just like, I don't know if this sucks. I, I mean, Michael Gallagher, use his fucking name. This whole fucking weird ass movie. We spent like six months. We'd go back. We'd talk about it. I'd add stuff. I was the old man. You're right. Around. Everything kind of just clicked. And yeah, so when my other movie got canceled, basically, like a month ago. Bobbleheads. And I was so sad about it. Yeah, cool fucking edit. Moon Burritos. Drive away. Yeah, I agree. I'm manifesting an extra $3,000 to send to Jake. <laughs> For being a real motherfucker and removing that better help ad. A true sister. I love you, sis. You know what? If you get $3,000, then uh, donate it to my uh, my fund for people with chronic illness. Because you know what? Here's the thing. I'm not like Shane. I don't need three houses. I don't need one house. I can't even afford one house. <clears throat> I can afford rent. <laughs> but there's so many other people who need shit. What the fuck? And Shane's like, I'm going to invest so much money into my new movie. Shut up.
about it. Toy Sketch was like, hey, let's fucking do the other movie. Like, let's do that. And I was like, you know what? Yeah, fuck it. Like, that's the one I'm most excited about right now anyway. So let me get to my little director's statement of why I want to make it. I'm going to move to a different area. Let's go. I'm out of breath and I'm doing the thing where I'm pretending I'm not. I don't know why I'm so nervous. I think I'm nervous because this is like stuff I haven't really shown or talked about. I don't know. Like people. No, I think you're nervous because you know that the product is going to be shit like every other movie that you fucking made. You're not nervous about that. You're nervous about the fucking response to your shitty art. Art that you're going to be putting out. People don't know me for making movies or writing or any of that. Even though I've made a movie before and I've written books, still I feel like people never really took it seriously. So it's like weird to- Nobody's gonna take your shit seriously. Make another name, make a different name. Genuinely, pull, pull a JK Rowling. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> <laughs> kind of the same, kind of twinsies. Put myself out there, talk about it, but I do want to talk about it more because I want to manifest it. I want it to happen so bad. So, okay, here's my director's statement. In life's worst moments. Yeah, fuck that. Read to me, daddy. All right, let's skip ahead. All right. Yeah, Ryland, you sexy fuck. What are you doing? Uh, going house shopping? What are you talking about? No, we're going to McDonald's. What? <laughs> That's very different from the day I had planned. Okay, fine. I'll go look at your dream houses, even though you already have two. <laughs> <laughs> Christina Hennessy, thank you for the $20. Jesus. $20 is crazy. Thank you. Um, you mean we're going to McDonald's? I wanted, I wanted that house. I wanted that house. No, listen, listen, listen. I'm not trying to get another house. I love real estate. I just like looking at real estate and it's open. Sorry, Louis having a full on mental breakdown panic attack, as am I. Do you want to move, Louis? No. Ryland, if Shane had no money, where would you be? Where would you be? You want three houses? You love real estate? If you love real estate, then invest in it yourself with your own money. Or did you just get in, like, did you get married? Because now those three houses are what? Half yours? Interesting, huh? Oh, well, Louis done moving. You know I'm unstable. So he told me, he's like, Shut I have up, a house on the weekend, and he wouldn't tell me a price. And I was like, what's the price? And he's like, oh, I'm not gonna tell you. And I'm like, well, just tell me the price. And then he's like, well, we can't afford it. I'm like, well, I know that, but why are we going if we can't afford it? He's like, cause it's fun. And I'm like, we're gonna fall in love with this house that we can't afford in our wildest dream. So why are we gonna go there? And then he finally told me the price. How much is it? I, well, I'm not telling them. Listen, let me live, let me dream, let me fantasize. Please tell me how much it is. Because I'm, I'm going to tell you right now, my like dream house um, is any house. I'll tell you that right now. Anything to stop <laughs> renting. <laughs> like, we'll be donating to the Never Stop Fund. Thank you so much, Coso Coco. Tell us the price. Because it, you'll really, really disconnect from your audience. And I love when you do that. That shit makes me so happy. The houses that I'm looking at are between $150,000 to like $250,000, which is so much money, but there will be a mortgage. There'll be all that shit. And basically uh, houses at that price where I live are falling apart. And I'll take that because it's something, right? They have three goddamn house or two houses and they're looking at a multi-million dollar house and they're like, is it enough though? Yeah. What the fuck? Guys. And then it's on the way to McDonald's where we'll go do your thing. Somebody you said probably he's two mil. He's distracting. No, he's not saying more. the price. No, hell no. What is the price? Tell them the, tell them the Here, price. Let's show them the house and they can guess the price. Okay, I hate that that's kind of a fun idea. <laughs> and I'll reveal it after you see the house. Hurry, you know, it closes at five. Okay, fine, we'll go. But do you guys do this? Is this weird? We have always gone to open houses on Sundays and looked at crazy houses. This one I think is probably the craziest, which I would have to be like Steven Spielberg to afford this house. <laughs> but <laughs> but I guess we'll go and get depressed and then eat McDonald's. Wait a minute, that is a good idea. Yeah, just cry over our McDonald's. Show us the house. How we can't get this house. This is reliving my childhood. <laughs> Mom, remember this? Remember me? Mansions and Taco Bell? That's my new autobiography. All right, let's go. Bye, Louis. Fuck you! Damn! Someone said I've literally been in Ryland's basement before. I'm sorry.
cocoa, like cocoa puffs. Thank you. Now I know. But what the fuck? God, I really, really wish that they told us the price. No YouTuber does that. That would have been so nice. I would have absolutely loved that. Holy Don't shit. Don't worry, we're not going to go broke. Been nice okay, for hurry, me. we have to go. <laughs> hurry. Oh my gosh, what are we going to do? See, this is the problem. I'm out of breath. I've been getting out of breath so fast lately. Oh, uh, let's see. Are the Celtics up? No, the Celtics are losing? Shit. Hey, man, I'm the biggest fucking Celtics fan in the world. Sorry, I'm going to talk about basketball for one second. But, like, I was looking at prices for, like, playoff tickets, and they were, like, $200 each. And I was like, holy shit, that's so much fucking money. And he's like, yes, I want to buy a $20 million house. The hell? You make every other fucking YouTuber look terrible. God damn. What does that mean? You didn't even get the matcha I went to the store and got you. It's unsweetened and everything. The problem is when you wake up, which is, you know, unreasonably early, like nine o'clock. No, eight. <sighs> oh! He gets up at eight and then he goes to the store and he brings me back a matcha drink, which is very, very sweet. I love you so much. But by the time I wake up at, you know, a reasonable 1.30, 2 p.m., it's already <laughs> melted and I can't even drink it. I thought about fishing out the ice cube so that that didn't happen for you. Give yourself a good one. Talk, dude. I didn't do it. Oh. <laughs> Settle. Settle. <laughs> uh, someone's saying, uh, is this going on the channel after? Yes, it is. Um, this is going to be my upload for today. So, so ta-da. Now, I don't want to dox anyone, but I've only seen the picture of this house from the outside. Isn't this... This is Britney Spears' house? I honestly don't think anyone's ever lived here. Well, then maybe we're thinking of two different places. Oh. I thought we were going to Britney Spears' house. <laughs> Wait, this sucks. Where are we going? Are we not going to Britney Spears' house? It's unrealistic. And let me tell you, it's like crazy and over the top. I just think it's fun. Crazy and over the top while driving a $200,000 car. Mm. Yeah. No, that's cool. I've been watching a lot of million dollar listing and I just, I want to feel like I'm on the show for a second. Okay, I have an idea and let me know if you guys agree with this. Ryland's reality. I mean, duh, hello. Ryland's I'm not kidding. If there's Ryland's reality and I don't get a book deal, I'm not joking when I say this. I will. <laughs> never mind. Never mind. That's gonna be clipped. Never mind. Never real mind. Estate. Never mind. Hello, Rylan. At home with Rylan. I think you should get your real estate license, and I think you should do open houses, and then that would save me money. I'm down, but there's already a show for me, so I just gotta like guarantee that if I get my broker's license, then I can go on million dollar listing. There's another open house. Oh no. It's gonna be a long day. I might need my nuggets early. <laughs> okay, so it's that. Oh my god. I told. A house on top of a, on top of a hill, in Los Angeles. You, uh, you're going to purchase. That's going to be yours. That's going to be yours. It looks like the fucking Degrassi school. It's a mansion. That's because I drive past it every day. That I just want to like you for see what's inside. Sister. I mean, this. If you guys keep becoming sisters, I'm gonna buy this house. I'm gonna buy this house right now. Is a I mansion. Oh my. I'll scroll up a little bit. Somebody find this house for me, please. I mean, that's over $10 million. In California? Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Think of how many fucking playdates your children can have in there where you set up ring cameras, Shane. God. It's like a mega mansion. It is like you gotta have a Britney Spears budget to afford this. Yeah, and I'm working more with, you know, the Jamie Lynn. <laughs> <laughs> no shade to Jamie Lynn, girl. Am you I make the money. This? Is this someone's house? Or no, it's brand it's new, It's new right? construction. Nobody's ever lived here. Okay, I just don't want to hit Britney. Nobody's, oh, it's new construction? <laughs> I mean, I guess we had to drive up the driveway, right? Because, like, a golf cart's not gonna pick us up. This is the driveway? This is like a Disneyland hotel entrance. Yeah, mama. What is going on? Oh. Are we going to be the only people here? Oh, oh my! Christina, thank you for becoming a sister. What are you going to do with that that big of a house? That's a good question, Galagny. What the fuck? This is GTA 5. Somebody said they aren't buying it. They can't afford it. 
I I don't. So they keep saying it's so ridiculous. We're not going to purchase this. It's so far out of our price range. But then Ryland keeps saying, uh, but we're going to leave today with a house. So it is in the price range, but they're saying shit to stay fucking like relatable. God, I, mean, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, should, don't we, know. should we bail? <laughs> like it is a lot. Like it's, it's a lot to show up to this house. Well, and also like me bringing a camera is so embarrassing. Like what do I do? Oh my God. What? Everybody's like wearing suits. Nobody's here. You didn't see that guy walk by? No. They're gonna think like, what are they doing in there? For I so know. Long? I kind of think we're like calling our bank. Hey girl, we're just calling our bank. Okay, let's go. You already showed that clip. This is like some Kardashian shit. Why am I talking like this? <laughs> wow, sports. I could never. I would use it. Shane. I would use it. I would use a soccer field. <laughs> I would use a soccer field. Can you house me? You know, just in case. Casual. Holy a shit, man. future twins. Okay. There's a playground. <laughs> Any guesses so far of how much this place is? Outdoor grill, of course. Someone said the house is $10,999,999. Million, so $11 million. Holy fuck. Holding up all my insecurities. And you know what? Letting them go. Shut up! That is the ugliest fucking jacket I've ever seen, Shane. You have <laughs> lime accents on a denim jacket. <laughs> this is a new video. Oh my god, oh my god. Stealing that weird shape. I, I don't even like at this point. Why are you showing this? Like, there should be things that as creators we keep from our audiences, right? Like, I have things in my personal life that the internet will not know about because that's the only way that I can stay sane, right? The internet knows everything else about me, but there are certain things that I would. I keep to myself, right? They're filming this only to flex, right? You've thrown all relatability uh, out the window. So, <laughs> so stop saying that you grew up poor because I also completely doubt that. I'm sorry. And I know that I've gotten hate for that in the past, but I absolutely doubt that because there is so much evidence proving that you're not. You grew up, you said that you grew up like on food stamps, but you didn't know generic brand foods or like store brand foods. What the fuck? Or like you made a fucking documentary about how your mom used to buy lottery tickets instead of like, and, and oh my God, Woo! my mom went fucking bankrupt paying for medical bills. Cause my dad wouldn't fucking pay for him. And he's like, I grew up so poor. Wait, but my $11 million mansion. Oh, mirror God for my damn. Weird shape me. Oh, that was kind of telling. Were those MTV Music Awards? Let me see. Oh, one sec. Sorry. Are those? Are those? Whose house are you buying, Shane? What the fuck? Just like blocking in my new house. Where's my master bedroom? Oh my god, that's a bad. Why am I scared? Oh. Wow. There's a hallway in the bedroom? Wait, this whole thing's the closet? Let me grab one of my XXXLs. Oh my god, I only have to see. What? Say X once, and then it triples.
There's two sides to the bathroom. What is that? Is that a big thing? You would never. I'll tell you that right now. Also, yeah, he could have. I take that back. He could have grown up poor. But if he did, that's completely gone from his mind. And he keeps referencing it like it's still in his mind, but it's gone. It's gone. If I. If I have 200,000 subs and I'm, I'm giving like $300 minimum to someone with chronic illness in need each month and he has 10 million and just pockets everything he's disconnected like what the fuck none of this makes sense i don't feel about that <laughs> you know how much i would shower if this was my shower really okay don't be too surprised this is in the prior Oh, they're saying it's a bonus closet. You know, just in case the garage size closet wasn't what? enough. Listen, what the hell I know is we can't it? afford this. But maybe we should try. <laughs> you know, what can we, should we start an OnlyFans and see how much we can make in the first day? I'm just throwing things out. Wow. Like, if we want to put an offer, we've got to do something drastic. I'm not kidding. I will buy both of their OnlyFans if that happens. Because that is amazing. Oh my God, that is amazing. I would love that. I have, I have, I, I have so many questions. I have so many questions. I, I've, I've wanted to see Shane Dawson naked my entire life. I'm, I'm, I'm not being serious, but also like, is it not crazy that that's like a thought in their minds? Like they know how young their audience is. Is your are your little underwears green? Are your little underwears green? Ooh, he showed his butt. Thank you, Duchess Ronnie, for subbing. Tier one. Okay, so there's a guest house next to the Shane says it's hot. Yeah, there's a fucking fireplace. Huge house. Also known as our podcast studio. Okay. My podcast would have to get 10 million views an episode. Oh my god, I'm gonna have a stroke. I'm not kidding. I'm going to have a stroke. He walked into that house and said, it's not big enough. It's not big enough. It's probably not big enough. What did you just say? Well, unless you had, like, this space isn't big enough for the podcast. I guess if we incorporated the kitchen as a background. He has notes. The $11 million house. This is crazy. I've never been a fan of mansions or like, you know, when people get those huge houses. I've never been into it, but this is really well done. Like it's very pretty. Like I wouldn't judge somebody that lived here. You know what I mean? Like sometimes you see a house that's so big and so expensive and so crazy and you're kind of judging them. Like, how do you live in that? Like, it feels like a big, weird office building. <laughs> this, I'm like, if somebody lived here, I'd be like, you know what? I respect them and I hope one day I can afford something like that. You can't afford something like that. I'll tell you right now, you made so much money off the Jeffree Star palette. Reminder to drink some more water, Carly said. Well, I've got Spindrift. I just fucking spilled some all over myself. God damn. Yeah, let me start that on these fans. Okay. All right, let's go to McDonald's. <laughs> Our next open house. Thank God. 24 fucking minutes in. And uh, now we're going to be trying the craziest food hacks ever. <laughs> oh, yeah. What I was trying to say is like, yeah, he's like warming his audience up to the fact that he's going to purchase that house at some point. Tastes better. Of course, I have to order because I'm driving. <laughs> what kind of nightmare thing are you going to make me ask for? Well, first, we should talk about the price of the house because we forgot to tell them. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Write in the comments below what you think it is right now. And I'm going to tell you in five, four, three, two, three. 
Ten million dollars and nine hundred and ninety-nine thousand. <laughs> Which is just eleven million. It's funny that even to rich people, they like took off a dollar to make it seem cheaper. What am I getting? We're here. Oh, okay. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> I'm so glad you're ordering. I was gonna do this alone. I'm. So that house could genuinely fit like fucking a hundred people. <laughs> if Shane started a cult, which he probably will, he could house <laughs> like a small town. So glad it's you. Oh my God, I want to die. Okay, so ask for a six piece nugget, all boots. Okay. Could I get a six piece of nuggets, but is it crazy for me to request all the boots? <laughs> this is like prank content. Oh, my blue bird just tipped to uh, $10. Boyfriend, if I was Rylan, I would make Shane buy this house with everything he has and then sue him for it. Honestly, uh, that's not far out of the question. <laughs> it's not far out of the question. But also, let me get back to this. What the fuck? This is like a goddamn prank video that like kids in high school would post. You know what I mean? Like, let me see all the boots. Boots the house down. I get a six piece nugget, but can I get all of the boot shape? What do you mean, like the. Like the, the ones that are shaped like boots? I'm just OCD and crazy. Ryland, you can't say that. <laughs> Ryland, you can't say that. <laughs> I'm just OCD and a fucking insane person. Oh my god. <laughs> He's such an asshole. What the fuck? He does have OCD, by the way. That doesn't fucking matter. It doesn't because he's asking for a like a different reason. If he actually had OCD and had like a worry and felt like he had to fulfill that need to have a fucking six feet nugget with all boots, then that's a totally different thing. But then he used his OCD as like a like a crutch to get what Shane wanted. Like you know how the nuggets are shaped differently. <laughs> I gotta go. Yeah, I, gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Well, no, there's the boot and the bell and the bone. Oh my god! Oh my god! This is the craziest thing I've ever seen! <laughs> I can't believe what I'm watching! <laughs> what?! Stop! Well, there's the boot, the middle, the bang! The boot, the middle, the bang! Please stop! You're also holding up the line! These 17 year olds with their first job do not have the fucking time to do this shit! Oh, I thought there were like specifically like boots, bells, bones. I mean, yeah, but you get uh, like really tall. Could I just request to do all boots? To, wait. Anything else? Anything else? No, just let's just go. No, that's fine. Don't ask them for all boots. Hack confirm. They don't. Shane, do it yourself. Do it yourself. They probably know who you are. Honestly, if you did what I know you want to do, Shane, and go. Hi, yes, I'm Shane Dawson. Um, do you think that I could get the boots and the bells that go ding dong? Don't like it. Don't do it. Well, she also didn't seem like there was really different shape. Oh, what are we blurring here? Oh, credit card. Oh, and it's a black card as well. That's good. That's always a good sign. How much money you have. Hans, thank you for becoming a sister. Get me out of here. Get me home. Oh my god. Oh, I forgot to ask for sauces. We need sauces. It's fine. I don't care anymore. Oh, I do. You're not even driving. <laughs> Just get in the back if you're nervous. Okay. No, I will. Don't actually. Are you kidding me? I have a six nugget. Hello. Yes. We're so sorry. You're my hero. Thank you. Thank you. We're so sorry. She was so nice. I hate us. I'm so glad that you did that and not me. <laughs> I mean, I'm so happy. Fine. Okay, time for the big reveal. Oh my god. If she did it, she's a queen. There's no way. If she did it, she's a queen. If she did it, she's a queen. Also, I didn't tip her. <clears throat> also, I didn't tip her. Thank you, Hee Hee, for the $2.
I hope there's actual piss and cum and shit inside that box. I hope that's the craziest food hack. And also, the title of this video is trying the craziest food hacks. This is one hack, and it's also not a hack. You're a hack, Shane! <laughs> Honey, thank you for becoming uh, a, a prime fucking sub. What do you call that shit? Freak out. Oh, I'm scared. Is it going to be all boots? Did we get any? Uh, mm. She tried. She tried. Boo, 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 boo. Oh, wait. Is that a bell? A bell. <laughs> oh, wait. Is that a bell? Oh, wait. Is that a bell? Well, I, I, I mean, I, I should have, I mean, I wasn't going to tip her anyway, so I guess it makes sense. Oh, it snuck through. <laughs> I can't really tell the difference. Now I know why she was annoyed. No, clearly a boot. Clearly. Bell. No. Ding, ding, ding. Are there actual shit? Yes! Ding, ding, ding! Yeah, I forgot what a bell noise was. I really forgot what a bell noise was. And then he went, ding, ding, ding. <clears throat> if someone makes me a, a, a Shane bingo card, I would absolutely love that. Let me put it. I have a, I have like a Reddit, a, a subreddit that I don't use. If somebody could put that in the chat, that would be awesome. If you put that in the chat and if somebody makes me a bingo card, I'll, I'll use it. That's so fucking funny. And now I have an excuse <laughs> to watch Shane's videos on stream. And, uh, I'm not reusing content because I'm playing bingo. I'm playing not bingo. Blast. Not the blast. I knew it looked dog. I know. It's still fine though. I'm still gonna drink it. Oh, and then she put one bean and cheese burrito, and then she put asterisk grilled. Mm. I can tell. I can tell. You can? I can tell. Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god. I know this is stupid that I'm excited, but I miss the grilled stuff burritos so bad. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I we should have done this to the Just burrito supreme. Open it up. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm excited. <gasps> oh, my oh my god. god. <laughs> 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 they grilled it! Oh my god! They grilled it! They gr I can't believe it! I can't believe it! They grilled it! This is the best news of my life! Trying craziest food hacks ever? It turns out to be the craziest food hacks ever! <laughs> oh boy! They're grilling, baby! Holy shit. Where'd my glasses go? I feel like fucking Scooby-Doo. Um. Uh... Hannah, thank you for the dono. Not my girlfriend. Uh, Jenny. Uh, yes, I, I would also quit if that was me. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is content. God. That's a game. It changed the whole game. You could do this to anything. Yeah, you could. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let me get in on that. This is the one. This is the one! Right, let me try, let me try. The boots have left the building. The boots kept walking. And you know what? Somebody said, what would I like the bingo card to be? I would say, uh, body shaming joke about himself. Um, put some other things in the chat. Because there, there's so many, like, uh, 2015 era joke. Uh, what else? Ryland asking about money. <laughs> That's the one. I, I just that. situated I'll a big bite for myself okay. and you took it. Look at that. Oh, Jesus. Uh, the taps. Wait, shh, shh, shh. Oh, shit. <laughs> what is going on? Mm, do that. That's the one. I don't think I've ever liked something so much. Wow, you're giving me the last bite. Thank you. The ends are the... <clears throat> Whoa. The ends are the best. You can finish it. <laughs> Shane! Okay, it is the end of the night. And uh, Ryland's in bed, and it's back to my office. I go. So hopefully you enjoyed this vlog, and yeah, if you want me to- Was it a vlog or was it a video? Oh, I don't think I even fucking showed you that. <laughs> That's okay. That's the only time that I fucked that up so bad. Keep doing these, let me know. Or if these are just too sad, let me know, and I'll stop. <laughs> and yeah, hopefully you guys have a good week, and I will see you at some point. Maybe My week's gonna be great. Off. I'll see you when I see you. Don't worry. I'm gonna I'll post see every you. single day scary. this week. Like so mm, you know what? We'll just say goodbye for now. All right. Hopefully you guys had fun, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna go. My teeth are as yellow as the couch. <laughs> it's the white balance, dumbass. You think you're a fucking filmmaker? Shut the fuck up. Whew. Hold on. Is this light out? No, change oh my the God. white balance is on Uber's auto, dumbass. Teeth. All right, I'm gonna go see Not you Not everything can be later. handed to you. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'll give you guys an update on everything in the next vlog. Oh, this is fun. Okay, or it's sad. I don't know. You decide. Okay, bye. No, it's sad. It's sad. I'll tell you that right now. Oh, and there's an outro?
Stupid. <laughs> oh, dumb, stupid, bad. Oh shit, that's really dumb and stupid and bad. Um, bingobaker.com. All right, let's see if it, see if I can do that. God, that fucking, that shit was terrible. Oh my God. All right, here we go. Uh, I don't think, I don't think that like, I don't know. Does this, ooh, let's see if the Celtics are winning. No, they're not. Fuck. God, it's because I'm not watching. All right, let's see. We'll call this uh, Shane Dawson Bingo. Okay. <laughs> Shit. We're going to have a new series on my channel. How fun, everyone. All right. Drag and drop an image. Oh, I don't want to do an image. I just want to do text. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to make it that deep. Five by five. Sure. Okay, here we go. Um, uh, let's see. Keep putting, keep putting things in a uh, free spot. Okay. We'll do, uh, instead of free spot, since it's almost guaranteed, we'll do self depreciating joke. Perfect. Okay. What else? Joke about how we got canceled. Great. Oh, how about just mentioning being canceled okay oh acting like he's poor acting like he's poor okay laugh snort great job not knowing how to use a camera great idea Ooh, let's see. Insulting Ryland. Ooh, that's pretty good. Ooh, saying I'm scared. That's a that's a good one. Okay. Cat appears. Nice. Uh Okay, yeah. Iconic. True. That's good. Bling cup. Oh my God. So smart. Black scent. What else? <laughs> Ugly clothes is really funny. And we'll decide. We'll decide each stream. Greasy hair. <laughs> That's good. Laughs at own joke. Great. Ooh, somebody said, uh, Jordan said mentioning, oh, that's the free space. Whoops. Oh, sorry. Laughs at own joke. Actually, I'll just leave this as a free space, maybe. And then we'll do, what did Jordan say? Jordan said, uh, mentioning children. Smart. Mentioning children in any way Oop. three mentioning him being a dad smart bad b-roll smart showing off fancy clothes just to wear the same outfit great showing off fancy Clothes. Wait, I don't want to. I think I just put something about weight jokes. Did I already put that? Self-depreciating joke. We'll do weight jokes as a different thing. Oh, yeah. ED joke. Smart. Uh, the face. Smart. Uh. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. talking to himself. You know how he does that? Okay, last line. Uh, 
Oh, bad bits. Smart. Let's see. Mentioning crying about Jeffrey. I know, but that's not every, that's not every time. Oh, we'll just put Ryland coming in at all. Ryland appearance. Piss bottle, someone said. Doing that tongue click thing. Does he still do that though? Does he, oh, talking about his movie, smart. And we can update this over time. Uh, saying bougie. Oh, stealing content's better. Stealing content. Last one, baby. Oh, gay jokes. Gay jokes. Smart. All right. We're good, baby. We're good, baby. Oh, my God. This is insane. Holy shit. Wee wee. Oh my god. Yeah. That's uh add more no public sure. Can I just like I just want to weird comment about Chris. Chris isn't in every one though, you know? Download. Oh, I don't want to show this. Oops. <laughs> I don't want to show you my shit. Uh Shane Dawson Bingo. Perfect, baby. Talking about being poor. Was that not on there? Okay. I would say self-depreciating joke counts. Oh, acting like he's poor. Acting like he's poor. Okay. Perfect. And we'll, we'll, I'll add stuff later on. And, uh, yeah. Not talking about his music. All right. Perfect. Well, then <laughs> free space should be video. Be yeah, that's smart. Video being bad or unrelated to the title. I'm going to do that. Actually, we'll edit that video being unrelated to title. All right. Okay. Now we're done. All right. I don't know how to do this. Share this URL with your players. Okay, does that work? Maybe. You and Hannah are so cute. Thank you, Gwyneth. That's so fucking nice. Uh, download. Okay, there was a link on, on screen. Maybe I'll add that after. Like in the description. Okay. Alrighty, everyone. I am so excited. This is good. This is good. This is good. This is good. Uh, if you haven't already, please follow me on Twitch. Um, become a sister, please. I've got so much content and I'm going to be putting more stuff out uh, pretty soon. And um, yeah, I love and appreciate you all so much. And I'm so glad that I can fucking do this shit and post this weird fucking content and you all watch it. And it means the fucking world to me. So um, thank you all for just being here. I'm actually going to, I'm going to raid someone on Twitch. Let's see. I'll, I'll raid AB, my, my buddy AB. Um, and, uh, yeah. All right.